Ukrainian nationalists have marched through Kiev to honor the World War II anti-Soviet leader Stepan Bandera. At the rally far-right leader Rolet Hanibok, who heads the Svoboda party, urged the authorities to return hero of Ukraine status to Bandera. Many Russians revile Bandera, born on 1 January 1909. President Vladimir Putin has called him Hitler's accomplice. Russia says it supports separatists in eastern Ukraine because of a neo-Nazi threat to ethnic Russians. Marchers carried the nationalist flags of Svoboda and the right sector, both movements which helped to topple ex-president Viktor Yanukovych last February, who was an ally of Moscow. Some marchers also wore World War II nationalist uniforms. Turnout at the rally was estimated at 2,500. Russia says some Russian TV journalists were assaulted at the Kiev march. Two women reporters with the pro-Kremlin TV channel Life News were attacked by masked assailants, who smashed their camera and stole a mobile phone, the Russian foreign ministry said. This is the latest glaring instance of the media being persecuted in Ukraine for doing their job. Ministry spokeswoman Maria Zakharova said. A man has been arrested in connection with the incident, Ukraine's union news agency reports. Bandera is a controversial figure in Ukraine. His hero status was revoked by Mr. Yanukovych. Despite leading anti-Soviet resistance fighters, Bandera was arrested and jailed by the Nazis during the war. He was assassinated by a Soviet KGB agent in Munich in 1959.